Tell me about these photos. Show it to the camera like this? Yeah, just talk about them. Is a picture of our baby at the time, David. April 17, 1975, when everything changed in Cambodia. My mom survived with six children, make our way to Michigan. When we first came to Bad Axe and opened up a donut shop, we didn't exactly fit in. We live in a community that's 97% white. In a town with less than 4,000 residents, it's not easy making a living off of donuts. So eventually, we decided to change it into a restaurant. It felt like building the American dream. And our whole lives just changed, shut down. This is a global pandemic. Increasing numbers of cases and deaths here in Michigan. Bars, restaurants, coffee shops, all ordered by Governor Whitmer to stop normal business. When you grow up knowing what it's like to have nothing, you're always afraid of going back to that point. After leaving Cambodia for everything America has to offer, everything we were afraid of is happening. It's a hard time that we're going through right now. Every day is a battle. If something happens to you, nothing matters anymore. Racist rhetoric against Asian Americans has become a real problem. If this community turns against us, then our whole lives can be wiped away. You're going to end up digging yourself your own grave. We got this letter today from a very angry customer. My family and many will be changing our restaurant routine, and Rachel's is no longer a choice. You could return to Cambodia for opportunity. Our frustrations with Bad Axe have forced us that much closer together as a family. I look at Bad Axe, and I don't ever want to give up on it. It's a place that I see hope in it. So our home, and we so love it. It's just amazing how much you get to be a part of this community. People can change. You just can't force it on them. This is our family. Dream of what America is. Love you. <laughs> Love you too. <laughs>